Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to another content video update. And in this video, I have the pleasure of introducing estimate templates and ticket templates. Now, for those unfamiliar, for quite a while now, we have had invoice templates. And what you're able to do there is assign a specific invoice template to a customer. So anytime that customer's invoice is created, you could have a customized looking uh, invoice for that specific customer and a different one for another one and so on and so forth. Or you could have different types of invoices. Maybe you have different types of sales situations. Whatever your case may be, you had the ability to have multiple. And after we released that, a lot of people said, hey, <laughs> I want to do that with tickets. Or, hey, I want to do that with estimates. Well, guess what? Now you can. So, uh, just like with the invoice templates, if you head to admin and then the PDF templates, there's a new tab when you get to say ticket templates called the ticket templates tab. And there will be a default one that's the template effectively that you had either customized or used the default one uh, leading up to this. And to create a new one, you just click new template and you can set a default one. You can name them whatever you want. You can preview them. You can clone them if you want to make subtle changes. All of that works pretty easily and pretty clearly. And the same goes for the estimate templates. You can just go to the estimate template section and then there is a new tab called estimate templates. And you can do all the same functionality that you could on tickets or invoices. One of the other really cool features is that you can actually assign a ticket template and an estimate template to a customer as well just like you can for invoices. So if you go to the edit screen for a customer, there are two new fields here, uh, default estimate template and default ticket template. And the default values are the system defaults, but at the customer level, you can overwrite it. And then all of the contacts underneath the top level customer will have their own unique estimate and ticket templates. Pretty straightforward feature. Before I go, I wanna show you on a ticket and an estimate where you can change it. On a ticket, there's a new field here called Ticket Template, and simply clicking into it, it will list all of the templates you may have, or it will respect the customer default. Quick note, if the customer has a specified default, it's gonna always wanna use that one instead of the alternate. So whenever you create a ticket, it's gonna start with the customer's specified default rather than uh, the system default if it's different. Just wanted to point that out real quick, just in case there's a little bit of confusion there. The same can be true on estimates. If you go to an estimate and pull it up, over here on the right-hand side, there's an estimate template and the same type of selections as the ticket and the invoice. Anyway, that's it for this one. I appreciate everyone's time. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.